in Durham, we're out here at Milestone, uh, throwing down the first Supercross laps on the Alta Redshift. I only got to spin a few laps on it up at Mammoth on an outdoor track, and I was really impressed with it there, but uh, I hadn't really jumped it too much yet, so to get some air and to really let the thing fly was pretty cool. Uh, hitting the triple was, was pretty scary the first time, actually, because you couldn't, it's not like putting it in gear and gauge it, you just had to grab a handful of throttle and go for it, and it was, dude, the thing has plenty of power, it'll make lots of triples. Some people are never going to let go, you know, even pre-mix, you know, some people just can't let go, but, I mean, really, the future's coming, electric's making more power, and things going to prove itself here soon. I think the bike definitely has the potential to, to go to Supercross and to do well in Supercross, and I think it's only a matter of time before, before it happens, and hopefully this year, at straight rhythm and some European races we can kind of you know, break the mold and build the foundation to go supercross racing here in the U.S. It's hard to say what the, what the next step is because it's all so new, yeah. the technology and stuff, but the initial response from everyone I've got, they're pretty blown away. They say, this bike is now, <laughs> and that's, that's really the way to describe it. Like The power is there and it, it doesn't go away. You're not going to have to grab the next gear, it's just power. possibilities are pretty endless you can you can take the thing anywhere and no one's gonna hear you so that's that that's the big thing as long as no one sees you you're yeah. you're in and out it's pretty yeah. cool for coaching I think there's a space for you know super moto altas uh, moto altas and you know I think free riding is really the, the the big thing you're gonna be able to take these things anywhere you're not gonna have people complaining about noise or pollution or anything like that it's gonna be You'd load up and go riding wherever you want. I took him around this year at Bam. I watched Hilson do some crazy stuff and he didn't get in trouble. So yeah, yeah that's what's cool about it. You can bring it, you can be stealth and pull into some locations and get right out of there. It's similar to taking your BMX bike almost. You know, you can go, I think, parks for these bikes. I yeah. think it's all gonna eventually go, go it's gonna get crazy.